he has had eight drug tests in six months and they've been negative. He just popped for, for a metabolite. All the experts say you couldn't possibly take the amounts that John Jones, it's, it's impossible. But it's not fair to you. And it's definitely not fair to John either. He didn't do anything wrong. We have every expert on earth saying he didn't do anything wrong. So the fight should happen. Some people believe that John Jones lost against Alexander, but me, I think he won. And I think Alexander is the second greatest light heavyweight of all time, right behind John Jones. I mean, if you say he's number one and you hate John Jones, then yeah, it's all right. But come on, guys, John Jones is the greatest light heavyweight of all time. If he just stayed out of trouble outside the octagon, then yeah, he would have been, everyone would have respected him. But what he's done, uh, some people lost his respect. But I mean, he's starting to become good and he's going to be moving to heavyweight. So I can't wait to see him in heavyweight and see if he can do good in heavyweight. Because I really think John Jones is one of the best fighters on planet Earth. And I think he's going to do good in heavyweight.